Happy Sabbath. Happy Sabbath. Ooh, happy, happy Sabbath. We only get to say that once a week. Once a oh, happy Sabbath. Happy Sabbath. You know, it's interesting to me. The first time I ran into somebody, we got into a conversation, it got into religion. It was a complete stranger in the store. And I was telling them, you know, I'm Seventh day Adventist. They said, what's that? They had no clue. You know, I'm sitting there telling them about the Sabbath and everything. I'm telling them about Jesus. They said, well, you know, I've heard of Christianity, but I don't really know anything about Jesus. I said, you've got to be kidding me. You know, I grew up Adventist education all the way through. And there are people out there who have no clue about Jesus. No clue. Absolutely no clue. So I thought it was very appropriate that we start off the entire set, just in case there's anybody who doesn't know, that Jesus is the light of the world, the glory of the dawn. Even in your darkest time, his spirit will keep us strong. We're so happy here to talk to you about Jesus and to worship with you this morning. This next song, um, all the songs are printed in your bulletin, but briefly I'll just say, say a few words about them. This next one, um, the kids really enjoy it, and I, I really enjoy it as well. It says, Ascribe to the Lord. Um, in the Old Testament, when God came down and spoke to Moses on the Mount Sinai, he came down on a cloud. And when Moses went up to go talk to him, God was telling him about his Ten Commandments. Moses heard God's voice, but the children of Israel who weren't on the mountain yet, they just heard thunder. They just heard thunder. Moses heard God's voice, but the children heard thunder. For me, when, that, when I heard that for the first time, when that sunk in for me for the first time, it really blew my mind. It just blew my mind. It just blew my mind. Because I remember being this age, I remember being at home, and every time there would be a thunderstorm, it would literally shake my house. And this is God's voice talking about his love. What happens if God gets upset? Have mercy. The voice of the Lord is over the water, the God of glory thunders. But then the rest of the song says, in the splendor of his holiness, worship him. In the splendor of his holiness, worship him. That song is ascribed to the Lord. After that, we're singing a beautiful song entitled, Come to Me, written by Craig Courtney. Um, God beckoning us to come to him and give all the burdens to him. And then when we come to him, we do see that he indeed is a marvelous and wonderful God. A marvelous God. And when we fully embrace the beauty of God, we get to see the things he has given us around here on this earth for the beauty of the earth. So we pray that you are blessed as we worship with you this morning in these songs. All right. 